In this video, we will demonstrate the rapid atrial pacing feature of the 53401 Temporary Pacemaker, which is often referred to as RAP. This feature can be used to interrupt some atrial tachycardias or induce atrial tachycardias. Rapid atrial pacing is for atrial use only. Before enabling RAP, ensure that the atrial leads are connected to the atrium, not the ventricle. Also, monitor the patient's ECG and blood pressure and ensure that defibrillation equipment is immediately available. To access the rapid atrial pacing controls, flip open the small plastic wrap cover at the top of the temporary pacemaker and expose the controls. As with all programming on the 53401 temporary pacemaker, the device must first be unlocked by pressing the lock button. Press the Enable Disable button once to enable rapid atrial pacing. This button is used to enter and exit rapid atrial pacing standby mode. The RAP LED illuminates next to the RAP rate. The RAP rate is displayed in smaller text above the current pacing rate. Once rapid atrial pacing is enabled, rotate the rate dial to the desired rate. In this example, the physician wishes to pace the atrium at 400 paces per minute in an attempt to terminate the underlying atrial tachyarrhythmia. Press and hold the Hold to Deliver button to deliver rapid atrial pacing. During rapid atrial pacing delivery, the previously set pacing rate and the wrap rate will switch places. The wrap rate will be in the larger text field until wrap delivery is finished. AOO pacing begins at the displayed wrap rate and current atrial output. The pace LED flashes during delivery of wrap pulses. The pacing rate and output can be adjusted while delivering rapid atrial pacing. Wrap delivery stops when the hold to deliver button is released. The temporary pacemaker stops delivering rapid atrial pacing and resumes operation at the non-wrap settings within three seconds. Notice that since the output was adjusted during rapid atrial pacing, the new setting is retained when wrap is terminated. This delivery of rapid atrial pacing was successful, resulting in the termination of an atrial arrhythmia. Once you are done using the wrap controls, close the small wrap control cover. Once you've reviewed the pacemaker settings, lock the device and close the cover. For more information and training resources, see Medtronic Academy. If the temporary pacemaker continues to deliver rapid atrial pacing after the hold to deliver button is released, press and hold the on off button to stop rapid atrial pacing. If rapid atrial pacing continues to be delivered, remove the batteries from the temporary pacemaker and return the temporary pacemaker for service.